let me show you a couple of points that I want to give you tonight to go. So number one, you have a cash account until you can be PDT. You know, until you feel comfortable to be pattern day trading. Two, cash out the starting capital, starting capital after 40, 50K profit. Okay, take back your money, start all over again, you know, but me, ideally, I like to put back starting capital into safer, lower returns, right? Safer, lower return, right? Risk reward, lower return, you know? Uh, safer into uh, long-term investing. And why? Because now I can use in real estate, entrepreneur stuff, or in my stock, you know, I buy asset that produces income. So assets that produces income, okay? Because look, even that Amazon that I use triple, let me show you. And we had a, a beautiful trigger. Look, you, you see on our full pro tools here. Here there was the trigger. So what did I have, right? I had a double top. I had a down arrow. See, right there. The down arrow is the intermediary immediate trend, which tells me the four hour, the 15 minute chart, and the five minute charts with the hourly charts are flipping on the downside. They recross our most important day trading zones resistance. They went above, recut below, that's a shift of momentum. And after that confirmation with the ping that on the weekly and monthly charts for four days, three days actually on Amazon. And that trade alone, that trade alone people gave me close to $12,000, right? You can see by the way, here I have a screenshot of the Amazon on one contract, one contract, okay? Um, the, I bought one put at 67, it went to $190, $12,000. So out of my $32,000, right? For the year profit, $12,000 was the Amazon, right? Roughly eight to $10,000 was the uh, uh, GBTC, the Bitcoin trade. And the rest, which is what roughly uh, twenty to ten thousand dollars to twelve thousand dollars, was the SPY. Always, I'm known to trade the SPY, SPX, and and just laser focus on those, so I don't have earning manipulations. I don't have to wonder what I'm trading. There's a lot of volume. There's a lot of open interest. You can get in and get out. But this was a life changing uh, uh, home run on one option. So people told me there was a good question this morning in my live room uh, and the stream on YouTube. They say, how much did you invest into this trade in relationship to the capital? Well, it's not difficult, guys. I had about $30,000. Uh, uh, $30, I invested about $6,000. So it was about 21, 22% of my entire capital was invested into this particular trade. I know it's a lot. Usually I don't like to invest more than 10, 20% on any day trade, but this one, I kept it overnight. I had observed it for weeks and weeks and weeks. And look, the tools were crystal clear. You know, if you go back to the tool, and now I took the 30 to 40 put here, tools were crystal clear. You look at the tools here, full pro tools, down arrow, recross of the 3350, cross, recross, retest the power line failure, and boom, I am into the put for two days and here on the stream live, cover the thing, you know. Uh, same here, you can see the signal on our retail tools that plug also for Think or Swim, right there, uh, which is our uh, cloud tools. And you can see same logic here, you know, uh, but different tools, right? Those plugs, are, they are not the pro tools, uh, but they are our retail tools. Look, first cloud went down on the double top. You had the signal of the cloud area between the 30 to 75. 
I got the 30 to 40 put, you know, same here, if you go into a 15 minute chart, you know, signal was here, all the crosses happen here at 32.752, confirmation of all of the lower high here at the 32.30 uh, 30 area, right? Took the 32.40 put, and this was a lifetime, a life changing for this particular account, I'm not talking for the life, but for this account, I'm really proud. That was a $12,000 boost to the account. So as traders, what will happen is you have to play processes, you know? So if you go back to the notes to help you when you grow those uh, small accounts, everybody, you know, you need processes. Systematic and replicable processes because you are like an athlete. You come every day, you know, and you have replicable, Consistent entry, exit processes and tools that you trust, right? So you don't have any hesitation. And last but not least, size and money management. I vaguely talked about it. Money management, because that was 22% of the account. That was not the entire account. Money if I had done the entire account and it would have gap up, gap against me, I would have lost. So for instance, quickly here, I was at about starting capital, 10K. The time I do the trade, I have about 30K in my account. So I risk what, six, what was the entry I showed you? 6,700, so let's say $6,800 on the put, right? Well, look. $6,800 on the put, you know, starting at 10K, I had $20,000 buffer and profit for the year to risk that 6,800. So even though it was 22% of my income, it was still a very defined risk, okay? So remember, trade SPY, turn your account into cash so you don't bump into the pattern day trading because it's very difficult to bump into the pattern day trading. It's not even easy to trade also with a cash account like I've done.